gorgeous day outside. What's up guys? How's it going? Mark from 408 on a new episode of what are we going to destroy today? So we got a bunch of snow and the team wanted to go uh, tobogganing. So it's a beauty day for it. Why not? Saturday. So I got the Maverick. These are the tires I've been running all summer on the street. So they are getting down. You know, they'll work in the snow, but they don't work great because there's not much tread left. And going up the hill yesterday, barely made it. So I'm going to swap out the old Super ATV uh, Warriors for the Super ATV Assassinators. Look at these beasts. If these don't dig in, I don't know what will. And they'll get a nice cleaning from uh, our last little mud trip up north. So I got her jacked up. Zan was supposed to do this and somehow I got caught in and doing it. But uh, got her jacked up. We'll swap them out real quick. I got the half inch DeWalt impact. This thing will rip the nuts off anything. I rip the nuts off the of John Deere, no problem. So we'll set up the time lapse, get her going, and uh, should be about five, 10 minutes. Here we go. Easy enough, about a 10 minute job, give or take. If everyone didn't stop calling me, thank God for that half inch to wall impact. It, uh, it has no problem ripping these lugs off, obviously. But uh, for down the track, those old vehicles, some of those old rusty Dodges, it, it'll break them right off, no problem. So it'll do a semi truck, so. Anyways, let's, uh, let's go have some fun with this thing and see how these things work in the snow. I've heard good things, so let's see if we can uh, rip up some lawn. Here we go. These tires work good climbing the hill. <laughs> Setting first tracks here. Oh my good, goodness, we're gonna be stuck Good luck. Amanda, you're too heavy. <laughs> oh, these dogs are gonna be tired by the end of the day. It'll be perfect. Yep. All down. <laughs> yeah, the only tree. No axe man. Huh? Huh? Yeah. Ugh. Hey, no going through the fence this year, eh, Zan? No fence. Oh, yeah, these tires are the ultimate hill climbers. I'm thinking we're going to jump that, that, and the third one. Maybe do a few launch controls up the hill, too. Yeah. Giving grooming rides now. <laughs> How's the toboggan? We need something to groom, so we grab that old tire. Grooming report. Boomer's like, oh, I'm in. Bigger tire. Yeah. We're gonna have some tired dogs after this. Hey, Mav, you got the same name as the as the ATV. Are you gonna come around the top, Mav? No, no, just wait. <laughs> He's just gonna run it. Oh, happy dogs, happy dogs. We're thinking of bolting two tires together. But now he's just getting out of control. <laughs> Open up that muffler, let her scream. <laughs> hey guys. Yeah, those assassinators work well. Hello! Hey Zan, when you get down there, open up the muffler. I want to hear it. Okay. <laughs> Pretty down now? Yeah. We just need to put a chairlift in here, I think. I know, I was just saying, like, at River Valley, they've got the magic carpet. Yeah. <laughs> she sounds good. On 
think he's grooving anymore. I think he's just playing. since I rode a GT. It's a lot of fun. That's too much fun. Oh man, those things look mean. Look at that. All right, school bus back to the top. Kick the tires and light the fires. <laughs> Zan, the, launch, eh? Zan the videographer is back. Where's your helmet? Oh yeah, you don't need one. You don't need one. Oh yeah, no brakes, they're just full of snow. No, no. You have a good time? You have a good time? Everyone on YouTube loves you. And Boomer, obviously. 
I'm gonna throw the drone up, see if we can get some footy. There we go. It happened. I was wondering if it was going to happen. Zan and I were drag racing up the hill. I was trying to get a drone shot. Didn't even get the shot. It blew a belt. So um, I'm going to get my truck, see if we can tow it with the Yankum rope. And if not, we'll have to tow it with the tractor later. But uh, yeah. Oh, these assassinators, they definitely like to eat. And I still have my stock clutches. So. But uh, yeah, I'm definitely impressed with these things. So anyways, we'll get our towing out of here and we'll uh, get a new belt on it. So let's see if we can do her. The old work truck. This thing loves to eat. Loves the snow. Can't blow a belt in this thing. Just a tranny, but that's just a Dodge thing. Holy Dodge is blow trannies. Well, Paul, we'll get the Yankum. We got the, uh, the F-150 Platinum with the old street tires. We got the Maverick with Sassanators and Blown Belt. We'll get, uh, we'll get the Yankum Rope out, strap her to her. See how much fuel we can burn. You did it! No! I was just drifting out here. I had to dodge this Maverick. <laughs> Good thing gas is a buck 55 a liter. And a buck 90 a liter for that thing. Snowmobilers over there. I'm gonna try and just winch up the hill first. <laughs> it just drifted all around here. It's moving a little. Need the high speed winch like Jay has. Dragged it a little, but should be should be fine. This is gonna be a long process. We'll figure it out. We'll get, we'll extend her again. Then we'll get the Yankum, get her over there. The thing is, this is just a big bowl. So anything I try to do, the truck just drifts down there. But once I'm on top of that hill, then I should be able to drag it out. Hey, I did say at the start of the video, I wonder what we're gonna break today. And we broke it. <laughs> Just a belt though, they make new ones every day. Need an excuse to open my belt housing and clean it out. Well, Mark blew the belt on this and I finished it off. I gotta pull her out here.
Pull, brother Mark. Pull, brother Mark. winching journey ever basically he's just winching up we release i get the truck more forward extend the winch winch up and we started way over there so yeah another 10-15 minutes she'll be fine just glad we can get her out of the field Whew. that was a good half hour 45 minute ordeal but we winched our way to the top i'm pulling out we got the yankum and the winch going we got all the sensors. Really burnt through a few liters of fuel, but you know, basically free these days at a buck sixty. So why not? Let's go get her in the garage, melt it off, and we'll change the belt tomorrow. All right, we just had a little warm-up session in the greenhouse. We're laughing now. He's just melting the snow off the brakes. A beauty little sunset happening. That's nice. Oh yeah, it's gonna be a fun night. That's for sure. So let's get her in the garage, keep the party going. She's back in the garage, safe where she belongs, melting out, thawing out. Oh, my light's on, look at that. Don't uh, let family members drive your stuff. Yeah, apparently he's got a very heavy foot, so. But no, told me to. We expected that might have happened. You know, I'm still running stock clutches, so I'm not too worried, but uh, we got some cool videos. We got lots of spare belts anyways. They make new ones every day, right? You don't break something, you're not home. Buck 90 a liter though these days. Might not be afford to fill this thing anymore. Justin filled up for diesel today. Guess what? He, how much it was per liter? Dollar sixty. Uh, sixty-seven. Oh, apparently my knuckle. Dollar sixty-seven. Wild, eh? That's crazy. All right, thanks for watching, guys. Go Stay follow Cloud Chasers Balloon Rides and uh, Freedom. Go get some freaking strawberries from his greenhouse. <laughs> we'll see you guys later.